what's going on? This is your fellow paisan, Mr. Rino Zaurini in the house. Welcome to my channel, Soccer Forever Per Sempre Calcio, and let's get into business. Chapeau, chapeau, congratulations, Juventus 2-0, like ragazzi, unbelievable, against Inter. Come goto, ragazzi, come goto. Oh, like, since yesterday, since this morning before the game, I said that we're probably going to lose because recently with Inter, we never had a chance to win the last year and a half, which you always beat them the last 12 years so. But that's the part of life. You laugh at us, now we laugh at you. That's a good you. <laughs> it is what it is, right? But let's talk about the game. Your first half, like, Inter almost scored. They, they did play pretty good. The Marco man, he, he passed beautiful assist. Uh, Dumfrey almost got close, but unfortunately, in those situations when you try to hit, hit, it, it, when it doesn't want to go in, it doesn't want to go in. But then I was thinking to myself, because Juventus was still playing the ticket tack uh, bullshit. Like it was boring. But then at the second half, Inter at the beginning, they were still attacking. It was like, we're done. But then all of a sudden, Krosti, uh, Kostic, boom, 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 boom. Like assist over assist. Like unbelievable, man. And the first goal from... Um, Rabiot, that was amazing. I didn't even notice. Like... Nice uh, asses, boom, you know. But then, uh, that tower tried, not a chance. The Jago almost got it, but then they took away that goal. The beginning, you think that wasn't a handball, but when you see, it was a handball. But then at the same time, the uh, Deville was grabbing him too. So, would that be a fall? A fall? With these uh, refs, man, it's unbelievable. Even yesterday uh, with the Milan game, like mistakes. Uh, that that was a handball, 100%. But with this new technology and all the bullshit, you don't even know what to believe anymore. Then they were attacking. Then they, at the 70 minute, Casey came in. That was like, oh. But then... How Inter missed the, the shot. Kosic grabbed the ball right away. He gave a beautiful assist. And who scored? Fajoli. <laughs> the poor guy was waiting for this moment forever. And finally, Allegri put these young kids. It is true that we don't have the top players. That's why he put these young kids. But it's good to test these young kids because these kids have green. That's what we need. Slowly, the pieces are coming together now the case is coming Di Maria joined at 31 minutes he, he, he did a great, wonderful job too I hope he'll be the next two last two games Verona and Sunday with Lazio so we're at fifth place now we'll see what happens hopefully we stay the top four by the end of this week and let's enjoy the rest of Calcio guys when it comes to Juve Inter <laughs> I just, uh, I just enjoy it. I enjoy it, man. People are saying, oh, Reno this, Reno that. Hey, you are enjoying it how we left the Champions League. Now, it is all coming back to you guys because you guys lost with Milan. Lost with us. Slowly, slowly, the pieces are falling apart. And now everybody of you are saying, Inzaghi out. Inzaghi out. Like, come on, guys. <laughs> Inzaghi, the bad choice. I soon... They had give a yellow card to his players. He changed the whole thing. And of course, the, there's confusion eh? and that's it. For Allegri, I, people say give credit to Allegri. I will give credit to Allegri. If he did not win today, he would have lost his job. So he did his best, but the players, you got to put the credit to the players. Because they probably sit down and say, we got to win this game because... We've been very terrible. Like, it was unbelievable. And after see now, 
that Kiss is coming back. Hopefully he won't get injured. Hopefully see some beautiful action, guys. That's all I can tell you. All I worry about this month, top four. The Scudetto, it's between Napoli, man, and Milan. But I think more Napoli because Spaghetti knows what he's doing. So I don't care what people say in this moment. Napoli are playing soccer. And for us, we just uh, got to be patient. But a win is a win at this point. So it is what it is, right? And uh, yeah. Nella vita bisogna accettare quello che è. Inter a casa e io godo. Purtroppo, ragazzi, questa è pur verità. Voi, se siete arrivati alla fine, ve, ve lo auguro per voi, ragazzi. I only hope for you guys can maintain the fourth place. If I screw that to goals, I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I only care about winning with you, but well, guess what? The more you mock on us, the more it will hit you in the fan, buddy. So if I were you, worry about the to enjoy soccer, and don't worry about your vendors. Maybe you might win, but today I was for sure thinking that Inter was going to win. But in paper, that's mean nothing. The stats say, oh, uh, Inter was better. It doesn't matter. Whatever it's in the field. And today we prove you wrong. We deserve the win. And that's it. No more bullshit. Okay? Inter a casa. Mi dispiace, cari amici interisti. Sorry for my fellow interisti. Cartonati. Vi saluto. Please subscribe to my channel. Uh, download uh, one football to know all the information. Because they probably... Be saying something about Inzaghi and all the stuff, even with the World Cup, whoever is watching the World Cup this year. And put a nice like, a nice bada bing bada boom. And I guess I will talk to you, lovebirds, soon. Ciao, ciao, by you. Sempre fino alla fine. Forza Juve e viva la Serie A. A casa Inter. Ciao, ragazzi.